Yeah, that's good enough. What's up, MS Evers? You guys will let me know when I start sounding like philosopher with that intro, right? When it gets a little too played out. I try to mix it up a little bit, like come in with a little more thunder once in a while, or kind of, what's up, MS Evers? Something a little different so it doesn't get too tired, but I don't know. I never expected that to actually be a thing, right? I just stole that from Mobile's wife, Kat, because she would come in with, uh, with a spicier version of that, and so I kind of stole that from her. What has happened? Lanjay gifting out a subscription. Getting picked up by General Thad. Thanks, Lanjay. We're going over your defense, which um, I just got reminded that... Uh, that I don't have your, your pictures cut up yet. So I'm kind of doing that right now. And then we have a couple of things to do today, which is basically crucible. And I'm gonna need my, I'm gonna need my homies for this one. I know most of what I'm gonna do, but I, um, I'm unsure about one of the attacks. Of course, I have the tangled eternal mess in room five, which, uh, I had a solution for that, but then I upgraded to mobile super defense, which took Apocalypse off of my roster for offense. And so now I'm not sure what I'm gonna use in room five with my two tap solution. I'm, I'm pretty sure I gotta two tap it. I don't think there's a solution, a single shot solution that doesn't involve either Eternals, Tangled Web, or APOC. Hold on, I'm just cutting up the last of these picks. I'm, I'm stalling for time here. Don't tell anybody, but I'm stalling for time here. <laughs> what's up, man of miniatures? What's up, Zero? What's up, Oella? What's up, Blake? What's up, Chris Van Buren? What's up, Commander Root? What's up, Crying Joker? What's up, Daddy-O? What's up, Damien Sapling? What's up, Digital Instinct? What's up, Dom Dell? What's up, Draft Snap? What's up, Dulo? What's up, Dinaterra? What's up, Ian Fachui? What's up, Father Fart? What's up, General Thad? What's up, Hedgehog? What's up, Kata? What's up, Commodore Red? I got it right that time. What's up, Lanjay? What's up, Lucky Chief? What's up, Lurks? What's up, Saney? What's up, Sean Woody? What's up, Sin Minister? Did I say what's up to Sean Woody and Damon Sapling? Uh, Zero in here. Gouda, how you doing? Okay, I think I got that. <clears throat> I think I got everybody this time. Okay. Hopefully. If I didn't say your name, say something in chat. Like Chris Van Buren with the emotes there. You can do just that. All right, so let's jump over here. So uh, we have a defense up and a crucible to do today, and that's about it. Otherwise, we can talk about crucible like everybody is doing. People are so upset over the changes to room five. Here's my take on it. Yes, it kind of sucks that we all invested in MOE to be an Apex Crucible team and then they make a room that we can't use it on. Damien Sapling gifting out a sub. Ravorn picking it up. Thank you very much, Damien. Appreciate that. You're freaking awesome. Uh, so it, it does kind of suck that they're like, you need to do Masters of Evil because they're the greatest in the world. And then immediately we can't use them in the toughest room. So that, that kind of sucks. However, I didn't want a cookie cutter solution to things. I think it's really cool that they're like, you cannot defeat room number five without buying the new warrior team. And we're already beating it. It's tough. It's certainly tough. I've got video after video after video of people failing in room five but I also have a lot of successes in there. Myself included, humble brag there. I had to two tap it, but it was intentional. We were complaining that the season was boring and now it's challenging, right? Yeah. Ravarn, how you doing? Let's uh, jump in and do an uh, arena attack here. Hey, two people not using Kang on defense in my arena. Wow, all right. Yeah, you two tapped it also. Rule number two, double tap. 
That's right. Don't forget the rules of zombie land. Okay, um, I'm gonna go here and see if I can make something happen here. Now, I don't know if he's gonna get ability blocked here. It, de it never seems to stick when it goes back to Hulk for whatever reason, I don't know why. Uh, let's do a little bit more damage here too. Lanjay with another gifted sub. Chris Van Buren picking that one up. Thank you so much, Lanjay. You know you don't have to butter me up for good grades on, on Defense Up. <laughs> Honestly, you gotta go to somebody else's stream and butter them up. They're the ones giving me the advice. Let's see, she's got nothing. I wonder, and I wonder, I wonder if she can, no, that's not enough health steal to make it happen. <clears throat> okay, and he is a striker. We're gonna go striker attack on rogue. I don't know why, I'm just gonna do it. I probably should have put it over there. You almost can't lose with this, right? We'll put this here since she's the only one that's not immune. And we'll kill a lot of people. Or we'll push a lot of people around. <laughs> she's a skirmisher, that's not gonna do us any good. Might as well put a vulnerable on Apocalypse. Boom. Well, that got some people dead. Uh-oh. He's coming after my king. Hmm. Uh, well, that's kind of my only choice, isn't it? There's the big ultimate move we were waiting for. And the comeback. There we go. Piece of cake. Pretty much do these fights on auto when you put Kang in there. Get the train going, says Lanjay. That's entirely up to you guys. <clears throat> what is this song? Oh, I need something a little more peppy than this song. How is this in my lineup? It is so slow. Does it build up or something? We'll give it a second, see if the song goes somewhere. Where's my music level at anyway? I didn't check that. Oh, my music is way quiet today. We can bump that up a bit. Oh, the song's building. It might actually go somewhere. Good, because I'm low on coffee today. I'm going to need music to get me pumped. Strike her. My arena shard at the top. All of us can beat each other. And the last 15 minutes before payout becomes a slugfest. Oh, man. Ravarn gifting out one sub to the community. Hype train inbound. Here we go. If we're gonna do a hype train, let's actually do a hype train, shall we? I have a hype train playlist. I have no idea if this is going to get cut from the stream or not, YouTube, so if uh, you miss out on this, I'm sorry. Let's go do a hype train. All right, what are we dedicating this hype train to, everybody? What shall we dedicate to the slugfesters in in room number five, we're talking about, about Crucible today. So let's give it up to all those of you who tried really, really hard to get through room number five. Whether you succeeded or not, I need this louder in my ear. Whether you succeeded or not, Good job for trying. Way to throw up your best effort into Scopely's worst attempt at making fair and equitable trade in Marvel Strike Force. That's right, switching up the rules mid-season on us just so they can make a buck on a team they're not even selling yet. That's right, the frustration begins early here in Marvel Strike Force. They want you prepped and ready with wallet in hand for when those new warriors come. But we say nay, don't we? That's right. We're not going to give in to the demands of Scopely. We're going to come up with solutions ourselves. We're going to come up with ways of beating the team in room five that don't involve the new Warriors. We can put this team on defense and still beat this team on defense because we're the Marvel Strike Force community. We get together, we get ourselves pumped up, we get excited, we theorycraft, and we don't let this shit bring us down. That's right. 
We come together with these awesome teams like a Minerva Sack and come back in with Apocalypse and the Darkhold to wipe this out on a punch down. But hey, that's what I had in my roster. We get together and destroy Cosmic Crucible events. They can't stop us. I'm going up against the same thing today with Emma and I don't have Apocalypse, but I'm going to have my friends come on stream today and we're going to figure something out and we're going to kick the shit out of this room number five. That's right. <laughs> What's up, Benny? We're getting pumped up on a hype train. This hype train is dedicated to all those people who do not give up the fight and are continuing to try to beat room number five, regardless of what Scopely does to us in Cosmic Crucible. That's right, ZKG, we're getting hyped about Crucible. We're not being negative about Room 5, it's a challenge. And we're stepping up to a challenge, not bowing down to it. We can beat these rooms because we're smarter than Scopely executives. That's right, we're not lazy, we don't wall it our way through anything. We use our brains because we're better than that shit. Yeah, and if you don't want to try and beat this room, you just mirror it and beat it. That's right, one step faster, throw in Hella and friends. You can overtake Emma. You can do to them what they're trying to do to you. And then if you don't want to do this in room five, I've got some crazy ideas that you could use. Let's take a look over here. Look at what Ciro's throwing up. Check out this. This is in room three. He's got over 20 defensive victories on this team. Yeah, it's a hodgepodge of, of some hot shit, but this was amazing. I was actually pretty astounded. That's right, Ciro, you heard your name. I'm showing it off here. I teed it up in the recap, but we're showing it off here. That's right, you can throw in some crazy zany stuff. You can theory craft, you can make stuff up and have fun in Cosmic Crucible. No joke, he showed me 20 defensive victories with this team. Now you might not want to use unlimited Weaver, Emma, Ultron in a mix like this, but he's got a wonky roster. And this is way more fun than the boring crap that they have us putting in room number five, the cookie cutter bullshit defense that we're already finding ways of defeating. We're on a hype train level two. It hasn't stopped, has it? That's right. If you're one of these people who doesn't complain about Cosmic Crucible, who steps up to the challenges that Scopely gives us, throw some emotes up in the chat. Let's get excited for this stuff. Let's tell Scopely, bring it. We can handle this. There ain't nothing you can throw at us in Crucible that we need our wallets for. We're sweaty, grinding oh, nerds on. around here. We can handle it. We can beat Wakanda without Masters of Evil. We can use Rebirth to beat to beat the Gamma team for crying out loud. You didn't see that one coming, did you, Scopely developers? Nah, that's because the community's smarter than you. We outnumber you, and we're never going to quit. I got some blueberries here today. They're keeping me energized because I'm low on coffee. And we're in the middle of a hype train level two. If you're going turtle defense, put some D's in the chat. And if you're going full offense, put some O's in the chat. Let's see what we're doing this season. Are we turtling hard this time? Or are we trying to bust people up with everything in our roster? Ravarn, Zero, Comrade Red, Blake, they're all offense, baby. O's everywhere. General Thad says, turtle soup, nom, nom, nom. ZKG's turtling up. Electric Wheels is a saying dodo. I don't know if that's defense, offense, defense, offense. I don't know what that is. General Thad's all offense. Yeah, I know what Landry's putting up. 
Defense and offense, splitting the difference there, huh, Big T? You gotta give him the O face. <laughs> Well, you can see what I'm doing. This is uh, Joshua's defense right here. Joshua, who has the guts to put Death Seed on defense. I'm going to have fun running over that one. My Rebirth team isn't big enough to take out his Gamma, so I'm probably just going to go Gamma into Gamma on that one. I might mirror this one as well. So there's three mirrors in a row. Haven't got a clue what I'm going to do with his Rebirth team because I'm using my Rebirth killer over here on the mirror. Then over here, this is what we're going to do, a min sack, and then probably come into it with a Dark Hold with Dormammu, maybe? I don't know. I might have to triple tap this. Haven't tried it without APOC. And then, of course, I'll just throw my Masters of Evil into room six. Didn't build it for nothing. And since it doesn't work in five and I don't want to waste it on four... Defense, offense, death, they are extinct. The only team I can't beat is Spider Weaver team I'm running into. Dom Dell, we're going over that today, big time. Everybody's talking about Room 5 these days. I don't know if you saw almost every single video posted on YouTube last night, but it was all complaining about Room Number 5 and a pinch of the Rebirth team being required in raids. All right. Fix the revive bug. The revive bug is only visual, isn't it? The revive on, on, on like Apocalypse, it doesn't actually revive him. Fighter Weaver, Eternals, Dorm, and 99. It is the death of me. So, worse than Dorm is the APOC one. Worse than Dormammu is... This hot mess. No joke. Mobile Gamer was the only person in all of Marvel Strike Force to beat this team yesterday. And I mean all of Marvel Strike Force. Doom in room five with that team is awful. No Doom revives. I gotta get off this hype train mix. I honestly don't know if it's um. I honestly don't know if it's allowed on YouTube or not, if it's copyright free or not. So we're going to go back to this song. Try this. Bring it back down a little bit. I'm starting to lose my voice. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to keep the music loud in my ear, though, because I'm pretty pumped up. I just don't want to have to shout over it. This song starts out slow, but it really picks up the pace. I like it. I think it's... Uh, yeah, it's Roy Knox. I listen to anything by Roy Knox. I think it's pretty good. You've collected all the level one emotes. That's amazing. Thank you guys for that hype train. That was awesome. Level one emotes. I don't know. I'll probably. I think I've got some emote space. I'm gonna have to update them. What do you guys think about this? Has anybody else tried this one? My problem is I spent so many teams on room five that I didn't have anything else left to clear my uh, your other rooms. Right. Yeah, you got to be careful. You really have to have a game plan because, of course, it's new, right? And when it's new, it's not tested. We don't have a lot of videos showing what works. Mobile made something work against this. But if you watch that video, it takes him three tries and he barely gets it the third time. A lot of RNG, it looked like, because like it played out differently each time he played it. I couldn't figure it out why. I'll have to take a look and see. Um, We can go take a look. Let's just, let's just go look at it. Um. Let's do, 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 do. Um. Here it is. I, I almost like that work, Taco Bell song. Try it. <clears throat> so here, we'll we'll watch this. We'll watch this. This is a really good video. 
go 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 check it out if you haven't yeah, seen I don't this. Think but this is gonna work. I'll show way. you how some of the stuff but doesn't okay work, and this. we'll get to it. Yeah, Benny, he did. He did. A, he had a lot of misplays and stuff. Uh, I think he had a misplay on the on the third one as well, actually. All right. So this is not going to do anything, right? So he's got Hella in there oh, with the Eternals something. and Weaver. Interesting. Mirroring the right, team with a little dying. extra speed. So we can actually stun Weaver. Holy moly. So he's blind. He can't. That does nothing, right? That does nothing. I bet a lot of people were screaming in chat, Benny. I was screaming at the video. I was like, why don't you use the special? He just totally misses it. The Taco Bell song is fire sauce, yeah. <laughs> I love cheesy jokes. <clears throat> so, when you hit an Eternal member right now, does it give you the speed and ability energy because they're functioning like a Tangled Web member? Because when, when Weaver's there, it says something in her kit, then when a Tangled Web member is hit, it's turn meter and energy. So I'm thinking if you hit basically anybody but Apocalypse, it's gonna speed right, them so up she missed. and put so out ability in, energy. In, we got problems here. This is gonna be bad. Yeah, we've got problems here. This is not going to go well from here on out. Yes, it does. Okay. Yeah, she's got all the charges. Yeah, yeah. they have because they're they're now tangled. Yeah, they have the, the tangled tag. Essentially, in the room, they have the tangled tag. I just want to show how this now completely... she has charges again, right? Okay, so she's charged up. We get that. We're going to fast forward to the next match. I, I, unless I was targeting Apocalypse and then he counterattacks, which worse? What it, I mean, what is worse, I guess? Like, it almost worked, right? Which is kind of weird. Here we go. Okay. So he did the flip. He's going for the stun on her. Keep her from getting her charges out. Never mind the revive over right. Apocalypse. It's a visual bug. He does not revive. The tunnel vision on Weaver is his problem. Mm, my speeder Weaver got stunned. All right, well, that will... Wait, Cersei needs to go to clear that, right? Now, see, he should use the... No, he goes I basic here. I could kill her right here. Oh, my God. He should have gone basic right there to get her lower, and then you could come back around on the next turn and use this special, hopefully, to defeat her. <clears throat> Scopely designed room five for the new here? warriors and, to counter um, it, but the season ends in six weeks, so we will have a counter for room five for one week, if any. Steven, don't be surprised if they leave this room in play. They, we've done two seasons of the same thing before. And they're going to do whatever makes them money. So be prepared for this to, right for at least room five to stay in play. Oh, she's got. That's a fully maxed Weaver, too. Uh, uh, one thing that somebody had mentioned right. in some comments uh, somewhere. Let's see. When does my Weaver take a turn? Holy moly. My Weaver could take a turn. We could get through her when she's weak. Yeah, if only. Um, one thing somebody mentioned in some of the comments somewhere was that Weaver wasn't supposed to be seven stars in everybody's roster. Oh, that's not good. And they it's might have developed hella. this room before that happened. They might have had this in... in as a plan before that happened. See, I think right there he was supposed to use the special, and instead he went with the ultimate. It's the Weaver revive that's throwing this off the most, 
Frankly. And so he should have, if he would have used the special, it's unavoidable and it would have killed her. Yeah, this didn't go as well. So that's why that one goes wrong. Let's go and find the, the third and final one. Special also can't miss. Yeah, I I get it. All right, so <clears throat> we get a stun. Uh, I don't know, Dom Dell. I'm pretty sure he's got with, he's got a with, uh, six red, fully maxed Weaver uh, as well. Probably. I mean, with, with a sliver uh, of health, that's all he needed to do is get through the barrier and tap her once. Plus, it's got you know she had the vulnerable, so it could have come back in with a double tap. Why Rest in peace, Amazon coins. That's Holy right. Holy, this is playing entirely differently this time. I don't know if this special is going to do enough damage with defense up. I can't remember. Yeah, it didn't work. So he comes back around if I remember right. She's so close. She's going to take a turn here. Yeah, inflation, right? Does she not have a um, revive on her? Yes, she does. Oh, there it is. It's hiding. He needs to use basic turn two Thank and you. special turn three it. after enemy weaver. But see, he gets back around to the special because they keep hitting her. And so she gets enough ability energy that he gets to use the special twice in a row. And so that that's what tips the scales. Once you get rid of her, now he can start hitting her. And fast forward through a very lengthy match. And I mean, he runs uh, the clock keep, down keep, pretty keep, low keep here. Your, keep get your charges up. Yeah, keep going after. Um, he loses his Icarus, and then it Weaver comes down to Come on, it Weaver comes down kill. to the yeah, wire. Yeah, yeah. But you guys get the point, right? That he's the only person to do it, and it's a very very tough matchup. What's this? Oh, that's this is brutal i immediately switched when i saw that video i immediately went in and switched my defense over to this and i'm curious because my opponent contacted me and i'm i'm and they said they had terrible rng i'm curious if uh how it played out in fact let me go see if they uh, replied to me nope they didn't reply to me dang it oh well i have no further information on that subject What's up with Amazon coins? I never used them, but did the, the... Okay, so first off, you have the imbalance of pricing. You have to use your Amazon coins in-game. You can't use them on the web store. And so you're losing value there because Scopely increased the prices in the, in the store on a lot of things. And then the Amazon coins, their latest edition is not a 20% discount, but only a 10% discount on them. So it doesn't cover the gap in expense. You have to make some wonky purchases and you're only saving a slim margin. It's just easier to just go to the store and whip out your credit card if you're a spender. Yeah, Domdell, I think that Mobile is one of those people who he he's actually a better player than he lets on. The the, the tactics and the skill isn't his shtick. But he's actually really good at the game. He makes mistakes like anybody else. You know, and Asiro, I agree with you. I'm not sure he truly understand what happened there either. But he got it done. And nobody else did. So that's a brag right there. All right. So I'm going to take on my Crucible match right now. And I need somebody to help me out. So I'm going to jump into the, uh, the usual voice channel. The stream channel. And if you guys want to... Um, you CAC members or whoever else... You guys want to jump in and help me out please feel free to get in there and let me know because we're going to do this we're going to go through here so like i said my plan is to mirror 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 i don't know what to do about rebirth i always use the essay kestrel shang chi on on rebirth how to be weaver eternals without a mirror and then Weaver Eternals, what I did, and so what I don't have available to do now, but what I did do, uh, I need to just have these things keyed up. No, not that one. 
this is what I did. That'd be a beautiful human. Hey, how's it going? Too bad. We got Rich on Ships in voice, and I wanted to look at this one right here. So this is what I did the last round. Now, this is supposed to work with Emma in there in place of Noir as well. But I went in with the Minerva Sack and Four Scrubs. So these Four Scrubs, they get killed right off the bat with the Weaver 99. And then it's Minerva's turn. You wait for the clock to roll down to the last four seconds. You hit her ultimate. It takes 20% of their health away. I don't know if that, I don't, I don't remember if they spawned in with revives or not. I, I don't know if that takes them under. Rich, do you know if that gets them under the revive point or not? I can't remember if they spawned in with revives or not. Uh, no, it, what it'll do is it'll, um, it'll allow, it'll take away Icarus and Cersei from um, doing their little stupid thingy where they heal up all the way. Oh. They have to be at full, yeah, they have to be at full it. health. The end that's of the it, match. they got to be at full health. So they don't do their heal. And then you come back in with Darkhold and Apoc, and this played out beautifully for me. Now, it was a slight punch down. What, about 100, 200K punch down? 100, 150K punch down? Uh, what's up, Big Selby? I, I don't know if you necessarily have to wait. Like, I don't necessarily know if you have to like drain the clock all the way down. Um, what to do, because I think Minerva, Minerva's going to get blown up right away, but because I think um, Noir or... Uh, Somebody's going to go, but I don't know if Icarus will get the heal on his turn. So it's you might not have to wait all the way, but if if you if you can do it, then I know I know uh, the safe way is to just wait until way, the last. Yeah. yeah, that's that's going to be safe. You might get added benefit if you let somebody else take a turn in there. I don't know, but I waited, and obviously it worked out really well. This is as clean a two tap as you can get. This this plays out so well up here. It was like, whenever I needed something, it happened. It was on that next turn. I was like, oh, this is exactly what I need right now. It just played perfectly. Yep. However, had I not killed Weaver when I would have, she would have taken a turn and gotten her charges up. Like, the next move. Like, it was right down to the wire. It played beautifully, but it could easily go wrong. So I'm curious, when I go through it today, I was going to try Darkhold with Dormammu and see if I can at least kill Weaver. Like, if I can kill Weaver and then come back in with a third team to finish it off, I'll be happy. Cool. The, only, the only time you're going to have an issue if it's a seven red Weaver, it's the only time it's going to be problematic because you, <clears throat> you might not get through her. So I've got a six red Weaver with full maxed, maxed out. So Yeah, you'll, you'll be fine. Should be challenging, though. So what do you think I should use on the Rebirth team? <laughs> Eternals? No, I'm just kidding. My Eternals are on defense. Um, what do you have right now? TDATs, we're, we're not recording. We're doing my Crucible. Um, so what I normally use is the SA Kestrel, but I'm, yeah. I'm wanting to mirror their SA Kestrel for an efficient kill. So um, I'm going to be using Darkhold with uh, Dormammu. Oh, I was kind of thinking oh, just using oh. Weapon X on him, right? Yeah, I... I I would um, weapon X shouldn't be the issue. It shouldn't be an issue there, because the main the main thing with uh, with them is once once you take down um, Captain Carter, the match pretty much is uh, pretty much down. And Weapon X has the the flexibility to get everybody. So yeah. All right, let's jump in here and see what we can do. Okay, we'll start with the mirrors. Let's go through the easy mirror matches and see how this goes. I got a death seat in here someplace. Thought I had a death seat in here. There it is. Yeah. And it's a punch across. All I got to do is uh, special instead of ultimate, and the rest is pretty much in the bag. It's so annoying they make time. Weaver the most OP character because, of course, it's their own character. Well, they kind of have to, AV Mail. The, the reason all of the original characters are OP is because they have no name brand recognition, so they need to make them great. It's why they made Jubilee the legendary instead of Iceman. Everybody wanted Iceman to be the Omega one and they did it as jubilee because iceman's name brand recognition will carry the sales where jubilee needs a little uptick even though she's got name brand recognition she's not exactly a legendary character you know what i mean all right i was gonna tell you to talk, make sure you targeted dark beast so um but yeah but the other thing too is remember so while she's while she's overpowered like at, at this point 
without that mistake, there's still only a select amount of people in the community with a seven red weaver. You know, it's not everyone's supposed to have a six, seven red weaver at this point. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So she's she's more OP than we we planned on her being. I think I can go into Nemesis. I should probably should go after Archangel since he's not blind, but. Oh, no, wow. Nemes Nemesis is the right move. That way he doesn't give the um, speed speed ups and the counters and stuff. I can't remember. This is where I always wonder, do I want to go special or do I want to go ultimate? It really doesn't matter too much. The ultimate's going to do... Um, You're going to slow him down. That's, yeah, the ultimate's going to give the slow, which is... Oh, sh I didn't mean to click basic. That was stupid. It's all right. <laughs> that was just a misclick right there. It's not a big deal. He's still dead, so I Should guess we, it. You know I what? saved it for the next one. Yeah, can't decide between the ultimate and the special. Just basic. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> mm, Three fifty and reduce the speed bar. That's yeah, what I'm gonna yeah, reduce there, that speed then. bar, and then Archangel should be the next one to go. Markos P with the follow. Thank you. Probably not probably, pronouncing that right. You lost a single efficiency point. Did I? I don't know. I'm just. <clears throat> All right, there we go. Yeah, you, you took That's... you took one extra turn than you should have there, which. OK. Oh, oh, well. oh no. Well, uh, my opponent already contacted me and said that they had terrible RNG and I put up the APOC Tangled Eternal defense. So I don't I, I doubt they beat that. But we'll see if they watch me, they're watching mobile, so they probably know what to do. Probably because right. you're a horrible person, but. I am a horrible person. I've never denied that. No, that... All right. So we're going to do the mirror. Because I'm a glutton for punishment. And um... it, you know, it, the mirror, the mirror is, is a good it's a good move to do the mirror, particularly if you know your opponent had bad RNG because mm -hmm. uh, the mirror is going to win. It's going to be a slog on efficiency, but it's going to win. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for defending me, Sam. Just I appreciate that. What's up, Stocky? Okay. Uh, basically, I just basic a lot until my Red yeah. Hulk pops off. It's pretty yeah. much how it goes. Uh, is there a... Sp I can never decide who I want to, like, really go after, whether it be She-Hulk or Green Hulk, because of who's going to taunt first and how it times out. I don't really pay attention, and I usually just end up... Um, doing things like going over here and rewinding yeah. She-Hulk. I, I would do that side, go after She-Hulk, because you also rewind Brawn there. Brawn, so. so I don't get the yeah. Im immunity. How did he get an immunity? Oh, it's gone now. Yeah, that, yeah. Did you see that? He had an immunity for his first turn, and then it was gone. That's weird. All right, so we're going to do a basic attack into She-Hulk, because, ooh, my Hulk is stunned. That's not good. Hmm. Let's do a taunt. Let's do a taunt. I think I will. I think I'm going to taunt. And then we need the cleanse. This is a 30% health. Uh, steals 35% health. So we're going to use that on Red Hulk to really get him uh, down a bit. We'll accept the charges there. And then we can stun him right here. Yep. This will be fantastic. And She-Hulk is about to take a turn, I think. What the heck just happened there? Uh, oh, Brawn took Braun, a turn and yeah. cleansed it, didn't he? Okay, well, that was no good. Uh, she's the only person without... Without yeah, anything. <clears throat> Stun her and then... then uh, well, everyone's got immunity anyways, but... Yeah. <laughs> We'll just keep going after Braun for a minute. Hopefully my Red Hulk will get some charges. <clears throat> uh, that's not going to do me any good, so I'll just do yeah. basic. And we'll go over here, keep working on She-Hulk while we can. Just waiting for them to trigger my, my Hulk. Uh, this is going to yeah, be... Yeah, rewind. Rewinder <clears throat> and keep her give stunned. My, give myself a little health, which is nice. We're going to put up a taunt over here. 
which doesn't seem to do any good because they just target around him. And we'll go with uh, it's, it's going to be the deflex, health. or I mean uh, uh, counter counters. counters eh, we'll yeah, we'll get the counters. We'll get the counters. This is terribly. This is terrible. Rich, steer the ship around and get him to victory. They say. <laughs> uh, we'll just keep working on these guys, I guess. I am way too drunk to drive the ship. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't want to. I don't want to rebound over and hit Red Hulk yet. <clears throat> Man, they're taking their sweet time trying to get to my uh, trying to trigger my Red Hulk. Yeah, but pretty much right now, what you you pretty much want to um, you pretty much want to keep uh, if if you're a bomb or a uh, she Hulk get their stun back. You just want to kind of hold it for now, mm -hmm. just so that way when you get down there, She Hulk right now, um, you can use the stun on Red Hulk so he doesn't get the charges. But I think I got this now. Yeah, just be careful at time. Oh my goodness. He's got like 80% of his health bar in that last tick. Let's go. This should. It's a striker or raider. So uh, we'll go. It's going to hit him no matter what. I just want to get rid of that abomination. Come on, somebody. There we go. He's going to get his turn meter bar there. He's about to pop off. Somebody stun him quick. Let's go. Uh oh, this is really going to kill my efficiency. Oh my goodness, just kill him already. Yeah, I was going to say, I was giving you the one minute warning. But... Running out of time here. This is so sloppy. There's nothing now, wrong with sloppy. Alternatively, I could have used the. What the I could have used the Doom Red Guardian counter, and it would have worked okay. But it's hard to trigger your doom outside of certain rooms. You know, your doom doesn't go under 50% with that one. And I kind of want to save as much stuff as I possibly can in case room five goes sideways. That's why I'm doing these sloppy attacks in here. Now, Jazua has already said that he had terrible RNG. I don't know his score, and I don't know if he cleared my room five. Terrible RNG means you've lost. he lost at least more than once. Yeah? Yeah. So that means he's he probably most likely he probably he messed up on the spider room probably twice and he probably messed up on another one of your rooms. So. Well, I hope so. so. If, huh? I, if no. he just if he just no, messed up not on that at spider all. room, he not said, any fucking oh, planet. That, that spider room sucked or whatever. Yeah, he would, he would not have said again. But bad RNG means he he, lost, he he got messed up somewhere else, too. And and. Uh... I forgot what I was going to say there. <clears throat> Is Purple Sticky here? Did he show up? He's too busy. He was up late sending me memes. So oh. probably still sleeping. Oh, somebody added him in chat. So I didn't know if he's in chat or not. Speed up. And then, oh, there's no Kestrel on their team. Oh my gosh, this is overkill. I could have saved this team. They don't have Kestrel. Well, let's get rid of Nick Fury before he does his super summons. Those guys suck now. Uh, everybody's pretty much got one. Wow, this was way overkill. I totally yeah. didn't need to do this. That was a wasted team right there. I mean, it's super efficient well, and all, but... No, not not really though, because um, if you don't have the speed on this, that their with their other team pops off, that it, it pops off. So right, it's the re this looks super easy, but it's just because you have the speed advantage here. Um, you don't get that speed advantage. That team starts going stupid. No kill like overkill. Oh, there's purple yeah. sticky. Hey, purple sticky, I was watching your video. I plugged it in the recap. Um, you got the sweet, smooth jazz sounds of stream beats going on in there. And at first I was like, what is this music he's got playing in the background? But I started going, you know what? I kind of dig this. I kind of dig it. It's pretty good. My, 
It's my after two, afternoon nap time music. He throws that on. I fucking get my <laughs> get my nap in right, right in the afternoon. It's beautiful. Yeah, Stream Beats is too slow for me to listen to on stream, but I do kind of enjoy it sometimes. That's baby making music. <laughs> uh, here, let's do the Masters of Evil over here. This should be real easy. Do you have all five, or are you plugging in? No, with it? just the four. Which I can do with just about anybody. I've done it with Shield Operative in here. It's not really anything. So, I'm not using this is my, a pretty uh, decent one. I'm not using my full. Uh, I'm not using. Uh, Omega, I'm not using the, uh, what's that? Weapon X, there we go. So I usually throw Omega Red in there just for the extra trauma. Yeah. But. Well, I gotta, Omega Red might be, might be needed. Yeah. Use Moonstone for the event. Well, I don't have Moonstone unlocked, Juicy. Don't you know? I'm not a whale anymore. Hey, look at that. They clumped all three together for me. That was really nice of them. Really, they haven't watched defense up. Now, I don't know if there's a better way to play this matchup. I've done it several times. And no, there's. And it doesn't like I, I you can pretty much hit auto and win so long as you target Black Panther first. But I'm sure there's like better things to do. Like I could probably do something to salvage that 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 guy right there. Um, um, absorbing man tends to die off and really pisses me off. There's like two that well, there's two schools of thoughts of you know do you go after um, one MM or Black Panther first? But what I'm noticing with the Masters of Evil counter, it just really doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah, it it's, doesn't. It doesn't matter. You're gonna win no matter what. It's just about what's gonna be you know save you one or two points. What does it matter, man? Um, he yeah. has immunity. I still want to go after him though. So, Spider Man finally gets to take a turn. I put Spider-Man in here because he's dodgy. That's that's it. He's dodgy. A lot of times I run Miles in here just because I want to make Zero happy. <laughs> but uh, no, Miles is actually good because of the invisibility. I put him next to Absorbing Man, and that works pretty well so that they don't bounce around. Like if there's a Killmonger or something, they, they usually don't. That helps there. Let's yeah. call in some more. I should have targeted somebody else because he's going to die on the first hit. That wasn't good. Uh, this is a... Clear all negative effects from self. This is a, uh, that's ability block and stuff. Is it gonna steal it? Uh, isn't one of them steal? The, no, uh, the uh, special. Copy and Copy clear and all, clear. that's it. Copy yeah. and clear. There we go. Yeah, like, <clears throat> my, my Absorbing Man's only three stars, too, so what I, I, I think some, sometimes, uh, at first I was switching him over to Fortifier just so he'd survive that initial onslaught, but then um, I leveled him up a little bit, and now he's, I think he's like 85 or something, and he, he just doesn't die anymore, so. Yeah. It's, he, he still has, like, he still only has, like, a sliver of life left whenever, but, he, you know, a few extra levels and he's fine. Mm-hmm. My, my Absorbing Man, he... he... He absorbs a little too much, I think. TLC, it's not that my chat doesn't love me as much as Purple Sticky's chat. It's just that I have I, I appeal to the common hardworking man where Purple Sticky sells his soul to the rich and wealthy. That's the difference right there. It's it's not it's not about love. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. He does he does he does have better hair than you too, so it's <laughs> Okay. So we're gonna try what what did we decide? Weapon X on this? I could do weapon X. Um, Am I sharing my screen? Yeah, I'm sharing my screen. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also I'm have the undying. A show here. I don't know if undying would for be useful. I think they cleanse too much for that. I have uh Doom, Dorm. I I kinda wanna save Doom and Dormammu. Yeah, I'd like to save know. Omega Red all for the for the Tangled team and see what I can do. I, I think you can get around this without, you don't need Weapon X here. Um, I don't know about the BA match. I don't think that would go great. I don't think so either. I, I don't, they're, they're not punch. doing enough damage to get through. You really yeah. gotta punch through and kill Peggy right off the bat. Now, A-Force might have some tools, but I, I'd have to sit down with pen and paper to think that match out. You, um, 
so A Force would do it. Um, A Force Doom would do it. It wouldn't be pretty yeah. because you don't have enough damage built up. Uh, Spider Woman is fine, but um, I, I don't think the like you, you, you pretty much either want to punch across or punch down on it. Um, oh, and the new warriors would be. Uh, I don't have them built that big. They're still like your tier 13, 14. More of Yeah, my 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 uh, dark hunters aren't built that big either. They're built big enough to do what I need them to do in war and no bigger. I can take out one point one million H for H teams with this, so I don't want to build it any bigger. You replace Deathlock with Kang and slapped Rebirth. You could probably use OR instead of Deathlock and do fine. The thing is, Zero, if I'm going to use OR, I might as well just use the full Weapon X team, I think. Yeah. And get the bonuses for pairing everybody up. Plus, I have the stuns, the rewinds, and all those bleeds. All those beautiful, beautiful bleeds. You know what? I'm thinking I may save the Undying to go back into the Tangled team. I'm just going to use the Weapon X on Rebirth and be sure I can take him down. Well, I can be run seven, sure, I can take him down. We're fighting the Rebirth team. Juicy says, if you're looking for a crazy one-shot of five, maybe something like Doom, Dorm, APOC, MLF. I don't have APOC, Juicy, because I'm a dick. Um, awful person. Yeah, I'm an awful person. So what I'm planning on doing is the min sack on five and then coming back with something, probably Darkhold and Dormammu or something let's try this one out see how it goes you should be fine here filthy casual players right hey ambassador i saw you're streaming now buddy somebody give that man a shout out would you i try to jump in there and give you a follow i don't know if i got it in time you were shutting your stream down when i went in okay so this is a good placement they've got going here i would probably yeah see they're keeping bucky away from peggy that's a pretty good placement i think Let's do a rewind here. And then we're going to stop her from doing stuff and things. I don't like it when she does stuff and things. Yeah, it's annoying, isn't it? And then hopefully I can chain all the way across. That'd be fun. Nope, we're going to get stuck rebounding. That's all right. Uh, this one is the offense down. This one is the disrupt to hero protectors, which will help. There we go. Sabretooth knows how to chain across. This is going to hurt. Ouch. <laughs> With the revive. I love watching the Rebirth take out, uh, watching the Rebirth team take out um, Gamma. Just just snapping off Red Hulk, snapping off Green Hulk. It's just crazy. Whoops, I was expecting that to kill Peggy. That was not good. That was not good at all. All right, uh, with Omega Red, we'll get his. Uh, yeah. He'll do the flip of all the thingies. That sucks. Oh, well. Oh, she just bled to death oh, anyway. The yeah. There we go. Okay. Could have done that a lot better, but oh, well. Peggy gonna peg you. <laughs> oh, God. Another clip. Building up a stockpile of clips these days. So, Rich, where are you at right now? Are you on a boat? No, no. I'm back in Miami. So, oh, good. Good. Um, How yeah, was your yeah, trip? So. It was pretty. That was a work trip, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I've been traveling. It's pretty much every other week for, for the whole year right now. So I have um, one more trip left. I'm going over to Spain for about a week. Uh, I'm in a conference next week and then I'm going to Spain the week after. And then uh, I think after the UK once or something like that. So it's it just is my travel time of the year. So yeah. during this time of the year, I just get all my travel done so I can enjoy the summer and stuff. Now, do you enjoy traveling for work or is there no time for fun when you're doing that stuff? Um, I started making time for fun, but um, it, it's traveling for work is it, it's it's more of a burden than it is like enjoyable. Yeah. So all it's, right. Um, I, I've never done this one with Emma in it, but I, uh, Purple Sticky tells me that it still works just fine. So if it doesn't, we're all going to go over to Purple Sticky stream and throw tomatoes at him. <laughs> hey, dummy, somebody in chat's trying to get your attention. What's up, Walking Hate? You really have the tools for a one shot? Yeah. Uh, APOC is on defense, yeah. You, you could have. Yeah, you, you. So the, the matchup here, I mean, you pretty much. Uh, well, what I've seen is if you counter it, if you do a direct counter and then. Um, 
what is it replace uh instead of emma you put in hella or something like that the mirror with and, a speed adjuster yeah. right right and see i've got tangled eternals with apoc on defense i wanted to test out the ultimate in defensive maneuvering and see how it plays so um that that ruined my hopes of using what was super efficient the last time on a two tap what's up zkg what's up Oh, Dorky's the community whooping boy right now? Okay. As long as it ain't me, man. Okay. For those of you just joining us, we're having fun watching clocks tick backwards. We're waiting I for the final clocks. four seconds of this match so that I can hit the ultimate on Minerva. On my sack run of, um, you know, room five, the thing everyone's talking about these days. <laughs> and enjoying some delicious it? blueberries with Rich on Chips and ZKG. ZKG, what are you eating? Because you're always eating snacks into a microphone. What are you eating right now? <laughs> uh, lightly salted chips right now. I think I'm. once I'm done with this, I'm getting those Cool Ranch Doritos and knocking those out. Oh, Cool Ranch Doritos are some of my favorites, man. I love them. The dork was on a bad losing streak, was he? Ooh, that sucks. Yeah, he was a little... The Super Troopers broke up, and he was just doing CC on Monday, and it just... He looked... Yes, purple, you know, it does go through the bad. barrier. It, it, it's a health steal, so it goes right through the barrier. Yeah. Sorry, what was that, ZKG? Yeah, Dorky was having a... He wasn't having a good CC on Monday, and then Super Troopers broke up, so he was all like, eh. Yeah, that, I watched that last war video of his. That was... It, it was a good video and all, but it was really sad. Like, there was just this melancholy feel to it. Everybody was just kind of like, you know, is their last war together? It, that's got to feel bad. So I do hope Super Troopers bounces back. I hope they, they get the alliance back together and, and bring it back. I mean, they're not going to shutter it completely, right? That's a that's an alliance in a great, you know, uh, um, shard or whatever, war shard or whatever you want to call it, ranking. So I hope they don't just close it up. Like when we ended the Cyborg Pirates, um, the, uh, the current alliance leader stayed in there, even though it was an empty shell. I told him if he ever left, uh, if he ever got his character out of there and left that alliance, that I wanted him to uh, change the alliance name because I didn't want to see it floating around. It'd make me too sad. Oh. I'll never put Tangled Web on defense again. Really? I, Juicy, I, I think it stands to reason that we we all should put Tangled Web on defense. No, I, I won't. I, really? I'm, I'm keeping it on offense, yeah. Yeah, something... I don't want to put him on defense. I don't want to... I don't trust it. Well, well, not even that. I mean, I'm just not an awful person like Run7, but... Um, <laughs> no, it's... Uh, hold on, hold no, on. No. He's a dick. <laughs> Having, like, once again, I think... You know, once again, Eternals Is this Cosmic valuable. Commentary? Are we on, are we on Crucible Commentary oh, yeah, no, again? No, we, we, no we're, we're attacking character here. We're not... Oh, okay. We're to, okay. No longer Crucible. Good, yeah. We, don't we make fun going. of my crappy skills. Be sure to make fun of me personally. That's the kind of attacks oh, yeah, I no, like. No, we're, we're going right for the throat here. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I think I think Eternals are too valuable of a team on offense. Just in, in straight up. Just, just them. And then Tangled is also another valuable thing. And then... Uh, if you have the ability to counter, uh, to directly counter um, somebody who does do something as you know mean and awful as Run Seven, um, it's it just it's better to have it. And then, you know, so what I what I what I have on my defense now, it's just it's all efficiency killers, right? So right. I have a ton of efficiency killers. So that way, I if I have my Tangled and Eternals on offense, so that way, like no matter what, I know I'm full clearing, and I know I'm most likely going to one shot everything. So all I have to do is have a bunch of efficiency killers. So that way I know that I'm going to get a better score, right? I'm always going to get a better turn bonus. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to have that all that value, value on offense rather than, you know, be a total horrible human being and have that stuff on defense. Oh, well, see, I choose the other path. <laughs> uh, I, <laughs> as, long as, as long as the defense continues to be as hard as it looked on Mobile's video, then I am going to continue using it. Did I just get her to use her ultimate as well? That was a counter, I think. Oh, was that a counter? She had charges on. She had charges on. She used her ultimate right there. Uh, she got five charges. 
Oh. She keeps the charges? Yep, she keeps the charges if she goes off him. Yeah. Oh. I guess I should have waited for two seconds, huh? When you feel the world is so that happened. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Really great if you had the mirror for this right now, huh? Yeah, right? It would be great. It would be great. Man, Can I wish Jaws you was here so he could let me know what, what his, you know, send me the screenshots of what's on the other side of this. Your pullout game needs improvement. Yeah, look at all that bad RNG, right? I should have slowed it down to speed one. I don't know what I was thinking. Obviously, I wasn't. Just do the other five rooms. Well, She's got the charges on going into this now. Is that correct? Yeah. But these guys won't do their heal revive maneuver. Cool. So the best I can hope still, for. You still could be okay, though. I mean, it could take a hit. I don't know. Good. I'm going to I don't know. I'm just going to go in and wing it, guys, because it sounds like I already screwed this one up and I didn't know what I was going to do anyway. So see, this is why I want to put my biggest defense out there for when people make a mistake like what I just did. Yeah. Oh, I should have done Doom. Oh well. This is so lovely. <laughs> well, yeah. that's all I got. Oh, they're gonna miss. She does have the. Uh, she has the charges. Yeah. Whoops. Forgot that. I'm not used to that happening. Yeah, you're, do you, you're gonna want a single target Emma here. Yeah, try and do basics as much as possible. Yeah, use the basics on her. Hopefully, oh man. Juicy just face palmed himself so hard he's probably oh. unconscious. Oh, there goes Darmy. <laughs> um, I can single target her with this. Yeah, that taco channel point you have you have where it says what the fuck <laughs> <laughs> we can speed this up a little bit more what? two two yeah let's clear some of the negative effects off of my team she's got one charge left and she's probably gonna take a turn before i get to do anything with that yeah she is <laughs> maybe oh Mm. You got it. Yeah. You should rewind. Yeah, you should do the rewind. It, it yeah. Well, it's a it's a done deal anyway. We're gonna. Nope. Yeah, we're gonna back out and try something else. Yeah, this is a done. I I lost this when I when I did the ultimate a second too soon. I lost this one in the first match. So, Juicy wants me to do Doom in here? How big is your Doom? Uh, ooh. Yeah, he he's, might... uh, that big. Yeah. But at least he's, he's got the unavoidable attacks, which... Which is what Juicy wants me to use as the unavoidable attacks? Yeah. Is there anybody yeah, else with unavoidable yeah. attacks I should sub in here? No, oh, no, they one, gotta no be one huge. worth it. Yeah, they'd have to be ridiculously big, and I don't have it. I mean, I could try. I could try Hella and me. You know, I could try putting Hella in here with Zim and see if they'll kill each other a little bit. But I don't think that's as beneficial as having, um, you know, these two. I don't have Apocalypse, X Man. I put Apoc on defense. I'm gonna no will survive. They survived pretty goddamn long. They took out Agatha. Strange. Yeah. I'm gonna want, want Dorm. dorm. Yeah, you might have to take out Strange, because he's still slow. Fuck it, I've lost this one. I might as well experiment a little bit. Funny if you can clear it. <laughs> That'd be hilarious if this works. Just random shit run seven throws in here. Get them to try to kill themselves. Is my Tony that small? Seriously? Okay, we'll filter finally. I'll just filter. Let's do it. <laughs> what the wow, he's 54. <laughs> okay. I want him. No, I want to do something different here. We're going to put you in the middle. 
Put you to the outside. I know this isn't gonna work, Juicy. You don't need to tell me. I know. I know, he's shaking his head right now. He's just, oh, he's, he's spitting mad at me. Icarus can't flip with Infinity Watch. I think I have Infinity Watch on defense. Now, yeah, Icarus is gonna knock the shit out of this team because I have Greg here. That's the problem. Yeah, but it's gonna be really good for your speed bar. <laughs> we there, know that there, this is not going to work, but we're gonna go and have speed, fun with it. Their speed bar is getting rewinded like a motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is this is just gonna be really terrible. Oh, it's gonna be so bad. You guys don't come here to watch me succeed, though. Oh no, no, keep, you deserve. They're gonna this. keep killing Greg too. They're gonna keep killing Greg, so it slows them a little bit, but it's not gonna be. They already slowed themselves, but they're still going. Okay. Single target, Emma. Emma, Emma. Oh, go after Greg. Oh, they just fucked with him. All right. <laughs> slowed themselves. Oh my god, him. please don't kill Doom. Let him take the damn turn. Please oh. let oh, my right Doom here. live. <laughs> Oh, oh, they, they got him left. No. They're not gonna let oh, it go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see. Oh, oh. <laughs> they were like, the no, 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 Run 7. You don't get to take turns in this match. <laughs> in the famous words of uh, Purple Sticky, full pucker mode oh, right now. No, no, not at all. Not a okay. fucking planet. Oh. Uh, Yeah, Zero, I know what I did wrong with the Minerva sack. I realized I should have slowed that down to one speed and waited for the last three seconds. I I was just having conversation. I was happy that I remembered to click it at all. I was worried I wasn't going to pay attention and let the timer run out completely. <laughs> but that's how it goes. Totally screwed that one up. Then quickly pause before she go. she does the move. When counter hits zero, it automatically unpauses and she will do her move and no one can go next. Oh, I didn't know. I didn't know you could automatically pause it and, and it automatically unpauses. Okay. Get fucked, Commander. Whoa. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself, Electric Wheels. Fuck. Take your Weaver off defense, bro. Or get good. <laughs> or get good might be the thing to do. All right, let's go over. We're gonna go take a look at uh, some oh. Uh, oh, uh, crucible defense. Now let's go. Here we go. Zero, zero had a good point there. He's like, if you um, once once you what? click the move, you hit pause, <laughs> and then um, I didn't when, know it would unpause it and play the maneuver before yeah, uh, when the yeah. time runs. I didn't know that happened. That's yeah. a good thing to do. That that ensures that it plays out the way you want it to. Could you now, or, Ciro? Could you could you do the move on one speed, then hit pause even at like four minutes left and wait for the timer to run down that way? Will that still work? Yeah. Hmm. Or just just hear me out. Could not be a total jerk and pull that team off defense. I'm just just Fuck no, hypothetical. Man. Just Fuck a no. hypothetical. <laughs> I wanna I wanna test and see how well people do against it uh, in, at my level. And after a while, oh. we'll see. When people start finding the one-shot counters for it, then I'm definitely going to pull it. Yeah. But I that haven't... Would, that, would, that would involve the other people not being jerks and pulling it off of defense as well, so... <laughs> right. Yeah. I, I haven't seen... So I haven't seen it this, this round at all. Like, so I've gone two matches in a row where they don't have it on defense. Sorry, I'm just getting some things... Getting some things going uh, here. Let's see. Lanjay, you're going to jump in on voice? Okay. Jump into the lobby, buddy, and I'll drag you in on voice. Let's go. Defense up. Juicy was entertained. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to know if, if a team composition really works... Let me test drive it. And if I can win with it, you know it's a winner, man. 
You know it's great... absolutely foolproof if I can get through it. All right, That's we a, have we got a new segment. We got, we got a new segment, segment, Ron. Yeah, yeah. Test, yeah testing with Ron Seven. Crucible's crash dummies. Yeah, Crucible's crash, crash dummies. <laughs> so we've got uh, Land Jay in here. Land Jay, good. Are you still talking about yourself? Do you want to go with Fly High or Land Jay while you're on voice? Uh, you can go with uh, either one. It doesn't. Oh, Thanks okay. for having me. Well, if you're going to be switching it over to Fly High, I might as well train myself to get used to the new name. Yeah, I mean, it's switched every game and everywhere, but I still got to wait another 29 days for a switch. Isn't that annoying? Isn't that annoying? Yeah. Yes. Ask, ask Wapa how that's going for him. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, YouTube, if you want to catch the video that we're about to make, then be sure to look here on this channel. It'll post sometime in the next couple of days. Otherwise, that's going to be it for this stream. So thanks for stopping by and, and hanging out with us. And uh, we're going to do some behind-the-scenes stuff, and if you want to be a part of that, it's Monday, Wednesday, Friday on Twitch. You can catch the Marvel Strike Force streams. Bye, guys.